Mm. Hey, to answer your Kwame, is the worst tasting stuff me ever taste in my mm. life. My son Kwame is watching from Toronto. So hey, yeah. What? So he just asked me how it tastes, Daddy. It, it, Herb, terrible. it don't taste good, son. It must smell good, either. Um, so, do me a favor, no? send some money for me, <laughs> yeah. so I can buy Western something sweet. Union. Just Western Union, so I can buy some. <laughs> hey. I love you, son. All right, let's move on. Um, the Minister of Culture, Gender, Entertainment and Sport, Olivia Grange, recently disclosed that a dedicated health insurance scheme will soon be in place for entertainers. Join us now to talk about this is chairman of the Jamaica Association of Vintage Artists and Affiliates, Java, and uh, big man, um, founded member of Fab Five. How much years now? 52 years. 52 years. Can you imagine that? No. Okay. And you know him how long, Frankie? Um, Met you in 1972. 50, 50, yeah, about 50. Met you in 72. 50. 50. Yeah, in, 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 in Toronto. Yeah. In Toronto. When they came up to um, Toronto. one of my friends, they put on a, a stage show wow. and they were invited up. Yeah. And uh, I was there. This is great news, though, this health insurance scheme. Well, well obviously it is. Um, the minister was really complaining about um, when musicians die, a lot of entertainers. Mm -hmm. we, we go to her approaching her to help to bury these people. So the first thing is she's talking about a burial scheme. Mm -hmm. um, because lots of musicians don't have life insurance. But over the last decade or so, a lot of us are now aging. It's an aging population. And of course, we are no ex exception to that. We are, you know, musicians are now quite a, quite a few of us. Start, all of us, most of us started in the early 60s to the 70s. Because before that, we didn't really have an industry. And so we found that for the first, for the first four, four decades or so, <coughs> we weren't dying, we weren't getting ill. Yeah. All of a sudden, out of the blue, yeah. in the last 10, 15 years, everybody started to just die and get it sick. You know, and most people, we don't really have an insurance. And of course, health insurance is very expensive. This, you know, this, remember, this you know, NIS never started until 1966, you know. In a national insurance scheme. So you can imagine our grandparents and great grandparents what they used to do back in but the day. But even with the NIS, so, people are still struggling, frankly, because right, so, it's so, it's so it was, minimal. It was never stressed. Yeah. When I when Fab Five started, I mean.